Hey what's up, we continue to review Nokia X7, and today we will talk about camera of this phone. In description under this video you can find links to unboxing, performance test and battery test. Also there are links where to buy Nokia X7 cheaper. The smartphone has amazing cameras from Zeiss. There is dual-core focusing technology, optical anti-shake and EIS anti-shake technology, AI scene recognition and front 20 megapixels AI beauty lens. The camera features are very impressive for $240 phone. So let's start camera review of Nokia X7 with specifications and then look at camera app, sample photos and videos. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel Tech Brothers. Nokia X7 is equipped with 12 megapixels main sensor Sony IMX363 with f1.8 aperture and 80 degree wide angle. The second sensor on the back is 13 megapixels Samsung S5 K3 L6 with f2.2 aperture. The rear camera has dual LED flash, face detection with dual pixel, EIS for videos and optical image stabilization. As for the front-facing camera, this is 20 megapixel Samsung S5 K3 T1 sensor with f2.0 aperture. The front camera supports portrait mode, AI beautification, and face unlock. So the specifications sound very impressive. But let's take a look at camera app and its main functions. Nokia X7 runs on stock Android, but camera app offers many interesting functions. The main screen of the camera app has following modes – Square, Panorama, Live Bokeh, Pro, Photo, Video, Slow Motion, and Time Lapse. Choosing the Photos mode, you will see other interesting functions on the top of the screen. The first icon is Motion on-off. The second icon allows to add emoji on your photos. Also, there is Beautification mode. One of the most interesting functions on Nokia phones is single, dual view and picture-in-picture -picture mode. The last two icons are self-timer and flashlight. The settings menu has standard options. Here you can enable scene detection, HDR support, shutter sound, grid, watermark, location tag and much more. By the way, the maximum photos resolution on the rear camera is 4032 by 3024 pixels. The front camera takes images with resolution of 5120 by 3840 pixels. Now it's time to talk about sample photos. I took some photos in different light conditions, so you can see how camera shoots during the day, indoors and at night. The photos in daytime are great. To be honest, I'm not surprised, because even budget phones in 2019 makes good images in good light conditions. The photos are bright and clear, just like they should be. The images with bokeh effect look good. By the way, you can choose blur level before taking photo. The selfies are also great. There is only one sensor on the front, but you can use bokeh effect too. As for the night images, I expected something more. In general, the quality is good, especially for $240 phone. However, the lights from the street lamps are very bright and they overexpose photos. It is better to avoid the street lights, but in the rest, the quality is pretty good. I also shot some video samples in daytime and at night. Nokia X7 shoots video in 4K resolution at 30fps.
So it was the last video about Nokia X7. If you are interested in this phone, then you should also watch unboxing, performance test and battery test. As for the camera, Nokia X7 didn't disappoint me. It has really good camera for $240 phone. The images in daytime, selfies and even bokeh are very good. The night photos are not so great, but don't forget about the price of this mobile device. This is not flagship. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel Tech Brothers. See you next time.